altitude of triangle find the altitude to side ac of triangle with sides ab equal to 20 ac is 20 and bc is 30 an isosceles triangle that's a good thing so let's start by drawing this triangle 20 20 and 30 we need to find altitude to side ac from b we need to draw a line perpendicular to ac and then find that we'll come to that it this seems like this is going to be tricky so let's find altitude ad first it's an isosceles triangle so ad is going to be easy because once you draw the altitude it will bisect these two triangles are congruent so the overall is 30 so dc is 15 bd is 15 so ad square plus dc square is ac square or ad square plus 15 square equals 20 square or ad square plus 400 minus 225 which is 175 or AD is 5 root 7. We found AD, that's not what mean asked. We found altitude to BC. Why have we found that? Practically because it is easier to find. Nothing more than that. Right? Now think about it. I know altitude and base here. You know the base there. How do I find the altitude? Equate the areas, plain and simple. Area is same. So half into BC into AD should be equal to half into BE into AC or 30 into 5 root 7 equals 20 into BE or BE equals 5 root 7 into 3 by 2 which is 7.5 root 7 and so the altitude to side AC measures 7.5 times root 7 use Pythagoras theorem to find this and then use half into base into height as area half into base into height with any base and corresponding height and then find BE. Technically speaking BE E does not lie on AC E lies outside AC it's an obtuse angle triangle 20 20 30 that's an obtuse angle triangle you should not pick that that's not going to change anything you still get the right answer BE is 7.5 root 7 technically speaking BE E would not lie on AC it would lie on CA extended important to know that but in this question it doesn't really matter even if we had drawn this diagram we'll still get the answer fine 7.5 root 7.